guys. I believe this is uh, Reykjavik Lake here in Reykjavik. Evening here, the sun has uh, just gone down, I guess. It's been gray all day, so hard to uh, know exactly where the sun is at. But anyways, it is like getting on five in the evening or so and uh, just starting to uh, get dark here. Quite a pretty sight. I've just been walking around a little bit. Oh, airplane flying over. It's a really cool city. Only about uh, 200,000 people. Um, this is the entire uh, population of Iceland, which is roughly the size of Ireland, is only about 300,000, so very uh, sparsely populated. Bjarni Fell Sport Bar. I don't know who Bjarni Fell is. Looks kind of like Billy Idol. Hockey Central, oh yeah. Sixty-six degrees north. That is the uh, latitude of uh, Iceland. And here's a map of Reykjavik. So I'm up here on Laugavagur Street, somewhere around here. Maybe that's what the B is for. That is the uh, Reykjavik pond that I started this video at. Walked up here. There was that guy on the statue. And I'm going to uh, walk back up Laugavagur Street. And it is 5.30 in the evening. Looks like a guy picking up something heavy. I don't know if that's buckets of water or what. Looking a bit Christmassy around here. I think I'll head over and check out this weird looking building over here. And here it is. Almost kind of a uh, replication of the uh, Northern Lights. Kind of, sort of. So here's a little Icelandic for you. Tak. Spirer Komuna i Harpu. Thank you for visiting Harpa. So that building is Harpa. It is a concert hall and conference center. And some of the uh, big buildings of Reykjavik up ahead. All right, a little hard to see what this is, but let's see if we can uh, 
get the uh, idea across here. Check it out. This is a uh, metal structure representing a Viking ship. And something else, out there, you can barely see it, there is a little shaft of light sticking up from there, shining up into the uh, clouds. You can just barely kind of see the uh, little bit of uh, clouds lit up there. And so uh, I'd read about this on the plane flying here. It is a um, monument to John Lennon. It only shines from October 9th until December 12th. And so that represents the day that John Lennon was born, October 9th, and December 12th was the uh, day that John Lennon was shot and killed. And so that is uh, commemorating John Lennon there. And here's a Icelandic uh, crosswalk contraption. You press the button there and then that lights up. Aktu Taktu. Looks like this is a uh, like fast food burger place. You are not going to believe these prices. I will do another video more comprehensively uh, showing the prices of things in Iceland. This is just mind-boggling. A burger or whatever kind of sandwich there, fries and a drink. 1,799 kroner, krona. That is about like 17 bucks. Four burgers and a fries and a Coke is $40. 15 bucks. This is why I'm not sticking around here for too long. Oh my God, I'd heard that Iceland was expensive. I did not think that it would be this incredibly, ridiculously, insanely expensive. So this is Laugavagur Street and Baronstagur. This is where I uh, started walking from, from my hostel, which is uh, down this way. Elds Midgen Pizzeria. London. And so that is my hostel, Flemur Square. I'll walk over there. And so this is the Hlemur Square bus stop where uh, local city buses um, come to. It dropped me off here yesterday coming from the airport, very conveniently uh, located for my hostel. Hlemur Square, it's called. And so I'm going to uh, finish up this video by walking inside, giving you a little taste of uh, the hostel and the um, pub and restaurant inside here. Thanks for watching and uh, lots more coming from Reykjavik.